So we're gonna need to find a way to go to war with Hejaz without bringing in the Mamluks. I'd like to do it that way, but I, I don't know if there is, I don't think there's a way to do that. Because this happened over the break, and um, Hejaz and Kilwa was gonna be somewhat tough, but with the Mamluks on their side, ah, uh, that, that is frustrating. Now luckily the Mamluks only have one alliance right now, and that is Hejaz, so it'd actually be easier for me if I just went back to war with, with, with the Mamluks. Uh, but our truce doesn't end until, actually that's a truce with Genoa. So my truce is up already? Really? That's surprising. Uh, okay, but here's the thing. Remember how much Oman and the Ethiopians helped me uh, in that previous war, so I don't know if I'm willing to just jump into this. Let me check on their military power, and their military size, where the Mamluks at. I hope they don't have as much power as they did before. So I'm at 44,000. Where's Mammy? There's Mammy. 23,000. Okay, well, that is... Well, remember, the thing about them was that they fought really, really well, as we did not... Uh, we were fighting horribly. I wonder how big the Hejaz army is, though. And if there is not a way... I might be able to... If I could declare war, there's Hejaz. 12,000. That's a little bit too similar, I think. Hot chocolate. All right. Good for you, finding hot chocolate. Uh, what if I were to... Can I declare war on these guys? Do we share a... We do. We share the Gulf of Aden. I could declare war on Kilwa. And... And Oman would join in. All right. That is how we would need to do this. However... Uh, I've got truce with them until when? Uh, okay, 1622. So I need to wait four more years. I don't exactly mind waiting four more years. I mean, I could rebuild a little bit more. I just, I'm a little bit afraid that bad things are going to happen as I wait. I don't really like to wait like this. Uh, let me go in here. Let me check on provincial unrest. Are we doing okay? 1.6? Oh, yeah, we're doing fine. Okay. I like to boost stability, but I'm just going to cross my fingers that something nice is going to happen with uh, some sort of nice event giving me extra extra stability or something. I don't know. We'll see. I could go to War of Sind right now, but I, again, I just think I should take a little bit, a, a second off here. Just a second. I mean, I've got no war exhaustion, right? No war exhaustion. I, there's no reason for me to, I guess, relax. Uh, I could go to War with Timmy. Is Timmy even allied to anybody? No, they're not. So those would be, I guess, an easy few forces. They've got fifty-one thousand. Yeah, let's go ahead and check. Let's just let's just let's just see where Timmy's at here. Tim, where are you where are you at? Timurids zero. All right, we're doing it. That's that's all you need to show me. You show me that one little number, and I'll do anything. Let's go ahead and, bam, get over there as well as raise our army maintenance. Point nine seven. All right, building a few boats here in the Persian Gulf. So we'll see how that goes. And, uh, all right, there we go. I couldn't have asked for anything better. Let's, the only thing is we will be acquiring a new border with a much tougher foe, but Yarkan was probably going to take over Timmy here anyway, so it's, this is for the best. Uh, I'll probably have to wait till August before I, before I join. Okay, let's go ahead and do it now. Uh, we won't call in any alliances. We don't need to. We're also going to get piety from this war, so that's nice. And let's run up in there. Oh, I should give you leaders, though. That would be a good idea. Okay, so let's move in like that. Let's move in like this. Where are your forts at? You have two. Okay. So we'll probably go after your forts first. Actually, no. We should we should definitely be splitting up so that they can't build uh, small units everywhere. I, I need to split some of these, like maybe infantry units up so that they can, you know, start to occupy more provinces because I'm sure they're going to start to try to build an army. So there goes one. Bam, we'll go a little bit further. There's the fort that we need to grab. Okay, so we'll, we'll, I'll worry about the, the southern half. Uh, one regiment will worry about the southern half. The other ones will go after the kind of the northern half. I'm sorry. I don't know why I, I, don't know why I got so confused there. I was like, what, what, what comes after north? South? East? West? Okay, so we'll finish this stuff up. And actually, when these guys are done, we'll send them up to the north because the south will probably finish their sieges a lot quicker. Um, this is a level 2 fort, so we don't need that many troops here. Stationed here. Mm, we'll go in the corner. Bam, you guys go here. Uh, yeah, we'll detach. We'll detach and go up this way. That way we say, ah, see, look, that's what I was saying. That is what I'm saying. So we're going to slow down our siege progress, but I want to make sure that I take out these troops. Are they, are they going to attack us right now? 
Oh no, they're sitting there. I couldn't tell if they were walking towards us or what. I was like, wait, are you serious? Okay, now you guys are done. And I'll bring in some reinforcements. All right, so we handled that pretty well, I think. I think we did that. That was kind of best case scenario. Where are you going? Oh, okay. So we'll select you, make you move down south, and that is it for Timmy. Timmy's gone. Well, I don't think we're going to destroy him here. I don't think we can. 109. Lose 14 ducats. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have to repay that loan, too. <laughs> Completely forgot about that dang loan. I'm hoping it's going down in price because it was la it was really expensive last time I checked. It's about 500 ducats as of now. If we wait two more years, it'll probably go down to 475, something like that. Uh, and I could lower... Well, I'll have the money after I steal this away from, from Timmy. After I steal all this stuff away, I'll have the money. Okay, let's go back this way and just get out of here now. 51,000 manpower. I'm at 43 prestige. Horde Unity is just fine now. Horde Unity has been really good. So I'm able to really, you know, go to wars very quick. Ooh, Elodia is at war with their northern neighbor. I'm If, if they take a lot of provinces here, I might want to ally to them. I wonder if they would allow that. I wonder if they'd let me. There we go. Military technology 16. I'm liking it. I'm loving it. This was also a very crucial military technology, so we get more stronger cannons. Do we get anything else? Okay. What's the next one? Uh, extra uh, cavalry shock. That could That is actually pretty useful for hordes, but uh, and supply limit plus 50%. Gang piety, thank you. Can I start to... Oh, I am converting things, something over. I don't know if I meant to do that. I probably did not actually mean to do that. Okay, and let me just... Oh, that's right. I forgot I had cores also still finishing up. Okay, let's meet here. 17 ships. Getting better. It's getting It's getting better. Uh, Yeah, I'm going to continue. I'm going to protect the Indus trade node because... I want to make sure that we can either pull more ducats, because once the Europeans start to come, that's when we're really going to be in a tough spot. We're going to lose a bunch of money, and uh, I, that's what I'm worried about when the Europeans start to send things around through Africa. It's it's possible that they might not. Some will always, the, south, the southern Europeans will uh, continue to try to send things through Alexandria and, you know, to the Italian peninsula and stuff like that, Ragusa and the Genoa trade node, the Vene Venetian trade node, stuff like that. Um... But when the Western Europeans come, that's usually when they start to send it around Africa. Because then they have all their colonies and stuff like that. Which it's about that time, actually. 1620. I mean, we're getting to that point in the game where drastic, drastically different things will happen. What is Portugal doing in my lands? Oh, well, you're black flagged. But still, I don't like this, Portugal. You better get out of here. Okay, let's go ahead and peace out the Timurids. All right, Timmy. So, bam. I'd love a vassal. Can I make you my vassal? Why I just want a vassal. I've been feeling so sad. I haven't had a vassal in such a long time. So there's no way to do this. I'd have to take like all your lands and then vassalize you or something like that. Vassalize like two provinces. Like I'm not gonna do that. That's for sure. Um, 35 overextension. I mean, I could keep you with like a divided up five provinces. Oh, I can't even ask for all this. Oh. Well, I guess you could have. Well, let me think. What what border do I want? I'd rather you keep this part here, and I'd rather take all this. Is that cool? Why is that still not cool? What What is going on? Why is this costing us? Oh, 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 that's why, because I still have that. Oh, my gosh, I'm so dumb. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so that's 77 over extension. I don't know if I want to take that much. 67 is good. Yeah, 67 is okay. And then I'll ask for all this. Um... War reparations, and that's that's it. That's all we need. Okay, bam. So Timmy, Timmy's down to a, a little a little block. We can, we also have a few more nations now we can go to war with. So that's also pretty nice. Um, the overextension is high. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Well, luckily, a lot of these cores are going to finish up. And I guess I'll keep this fort. Maybe. How much money do I have? Well, let's mothball the forts first of all. Let's lower army maintenance. There we go. We're going to repay that loan. I'm at 77 overextension. Okay. Yeah, that isn't too good. I would agree with you there that that is, that is not very good. Um, I can't put... Wait, wait a second. Where... 
where is my estates tab? Uh, I'm. Oh, there we go. I, I closed it for some reason. Okay, so yeah, you can have this. I don't exactly. You probably want a lot. Let's just wait for that to go away. Okay, there we go. We also probably need to increase some of the uh, autonomy. We need to let this region become more autonomous because I already know that I have Timurid uh, rebels within my region. Oh, no, that's not going to be able to happen. All right, well, let's raise everything that we can. I don't think Timmy was a very good developer of provinces. Um, okay, that that is about all. Oh, okay, well, you just didn't have some of those some of those provinces out here in the east. Okay. All right, that's it. Okay, so we'll stay here. Those cores will finish. I'll make a core here, make a core here. Doing much better. The core's gone down. Oh, overextension's gone down to 56%. And QQ tribes might rise. We're going to want these this overextension to go away pretty fast. Oh, it will. Okay, good. Okay, there it goes. 40, well, 46. I mean, it, not all of it is gone. Uh, we still have a majority of it. Uh, we need overextension to go away, and then it'll pop back down to, like, negative 5. I'm thinking something a little bit better. Oh, bam. All right, so uh, someone decided to use my army, I guess my war, to their advantage. Now the Timurids have, like, nothing. There we go, 42. That's that's a little bit better. So repay that loan back to 1,100 ducats. Or, I'm sorry, 101 ducats, 123 ducats now. I'm going to re continue to rebuild regimens, that's for sure. I think I'll build a few cavalry units everywhere. Since we just built infantry. We, we probably definitely also need a few more uh, cannon units. I haven't done a very good job at building those. Yeah, these things are going to be pretty expensive. Figured that. Down to 48,000 manpower. So, um, the truce is almost such up with Kilwa. But I don't really know. I mean, I feel like I should just go to war with the Mamluks. Because I, I need to go to, with in, into that war anyways. Uh, that's kind of where I'm feeling. The thing is, it depends on their military technology. Hejaz is behind in technology, so that's good. Depends on where I'm at. That's why I wanted to give myself time. I know that with a general, I'm sorry, with a military advisor, uh, and, and making nine military points per month, I mean, we'll catch up pretty fast. Uh, I, I even want, yeah, let's go ahead and get myself a, um, administrative advisor as well. If I'm going to buy, if I'm going to boost ability, it should, I should do it now. I, I guess I will. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? I almost lost stability. I, I, luckily, I just have to fight some fight some rebels. I wonder if I could beat them with like the uh, lower army. No, there's no way. Not that low. Okay, we're going to have to wait a second. Okay, we'll move down south. Prepare for this. Where are they located at? Perfect, they're in the desert. I just have to wait till probably October and then I'll be fine. Rebels were successful. No big surprise there. Okay, we'll start to move in. They're not at full morale, but with all the numbers we're sending over there, that's fine. Well, I, well, it was, it was. I'm glad that we sent over those reinforcements. So I'm gonna combine and split, and uh, let's go ahead and back. Let's go back to to the army maintenance and lower it again. Oops, that's missionary maintenance. I didn't realize I could save that much money uh, through missionary maintenance, especially when I have like two or three. Remember, I, I've gone down the religious ideas. I went down religious ideas, and I I was hoping to get another missionary, but. We'll see if that works. QQ is occupied. Okay, so we grab the rebels back. Um, we did take two forts. We do now have two forts. I definitely don't want these forts here. I'd rather just delete this one. This one can be kind of all around. One in the east for now. Yeah, for now that'll be okay. 48 ducats. Like I said, I've got 17 ships, so it's getting better. It's getting better. How does Tunis feel about us? Do you like us yet, Tunis? Do we have any sort of, like, Tunisian opinion? And then our army strength is helping out, too. I'd like it to be a little bit better. I'm going to go with that. Again, I've been continuing to experiment with that. Um, how about Kilwa? Nope. Nope, still. Just the world does not like us here. Oh, my gosh. Are you kidding me? For the next 10 years? No, that's not happening. All right, we'll just take out another... Take out another loan, then. Fine. I guess we don't have another choice. Uh, okay, so there we go. We're converting things over much quicker now. Obviously, still have a lot of provinces to convert. I mean, we're always going to be converting things over, but look at that. I mean, I, I love the look of, of the, the kind of Shia spread throughout the Middle Eastern region. 
Really like the way that looks. Uh, I, don't worry, I've also been keeping an eye on Russia. They are not down. They have very, they've, they've never been over 30 Liberty to Desire. Uh, I really hope that changes. I'm desperately wishing that that will change. Or some of the alliances change. Oh my gosh. Uh, Moldavia, Mold, Moldavia, 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 something like that. Brandenburg, Cologne versus all of these alliances. Well, luckily France isn't in on it, but for the most part, I mean, they're probably going to get their butt kicked. That sucks because their power, now it's going to get ridiculous. Austria, Austria will probably um, probably feed Russia, I'm guessing. And they'll, they, you know, Austria might even take some things away from Brandenburg. Ooh, I love Norway going into the British Isles. Did we, did we notice that before? I don't know if we picked that up before. before. Um, we should figure out who are the Austrian enemies. Sweden. That's right. I was trying to work my, my magic on Sweden, but I don't know if it's going to work. Oh, yeah, no, those those negative modifiers are way too high right now. That would be a problem. Okay, so the truce has ended. Okay, so there goes my truce. So I could start up now. Uh, I kind of don't want to, though. I mean, well, where am I at in, ter in terms of military technology? I could wait like another... Jeez, I don't even know. Oh, wow, I have to wait a long time for that. I probably shouldn't wait. I should probably jump into it now if I'm going to jump into it now. Let's pull back the army, first of all. Let's pull them back over this way. I think I'll send, like, yeah, 21,000 should be enough for uh, Hejaz. And then everyone else will go towards the Mamluks. And, and, and again, I'm not even done, you know, building up my troops. I'd like to, you know what, if I get to my force limit, it doesn't matter how strong they can fight, right? If, I'm ha if I have 80,000 troops, then I'm going to be in a pretty good situation. Uh, I'm going to build, like, three or four cannon units here. I'll do like a few infantry here. There we go. That's much better. Anyways, guys, I'm about to stop right there. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.